Theater 2202. I'm Dr. Kim Solga. You can call me Kim. Uh, and this is our fantastic classroom, University College 1110. It's a WALS classroom, which stands for Western Active Learning Space. And if you've never been in one before, I wanted to give you a quick introduction to it because it's completely amazing. We've got loads of technology. We've got projectors at every one of these tables. The tables are called pods. They're uh, completely wired, so you can share your phone or laptop screens to the projection screen. And all of the screens are also whiteboards, so we can do lots of thinking and planning. The best part about it, though, is that because we're in a hybrid situation this term with COVID-19, uh, we're going to be able to Zoom in this room. So on Tuesdays, uh, every Tuesday, some of you are going to be here live in the room learning, and some of you are going to be on Zoom. But because of the gift of this technology, we're all going to be together. So here we are at the center console in our classroom, UC1110. If you are with us live in person on a Tuesday afternoon, then you're going to come in through the door that I just entered through, and you're going to take a seat at one of the pods where we're going to be sitting two to a table. I know it's a bit weird, but that's social distancing. So you can see, for example, Leela and Devon are seated comfortably at pod number two, checking their email or Facebook or Instagram or something. Now, if you are with us on Zoom on a given Tuesday afternoon, you're going to be on the screens around the room, just like you can see Dr. Schwartzman, Leora, and Sheetala RTAR right now. So if you've never logged into Zoom through OWL, I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So here we are on our OWL site. You can see that I'm pretending to be a student right now. Uh, if you haven't visited it yet, by the way, please do check out the syllabus and have a good read of it. You'll see here in the left-hand navigation bar, there's a Zoom link. Please log into Zoom using that link because you have to be an authorized uh, UWO OWL user in order to access Zoom. So what you will see there is this screen. Now, right now, here in this room, we're not configured to nip over to Zoom. But what will happen on your screen is that you'll automatically be bounced over to Zoom. Once you have been redirected to Zoom, you're going to see a list of your meetings. And in those are going to be all of our class meetings. All you're going to have to do then is click Join, and you'll be inside the Zoom room as an authorized user. So when we're in class, obviously, we don't want to spend all of our time staring at each other. Although I actually think that's kind of a cool feature of the walls, rooms, that you can sit together and talk and look at each other rather than looking at me all the time. But of course, we're also going to want to look at our prep and at the cool responses that you guys are going to be posting on our WordPress site to the stuff that you're reading and to what one another is saying about it. So in order to make that easy for us when we're all together in this hybrid environment, I'm going to use the screen share function in Zoom. Let me get that started right now. So I'm sharing my screen now. And you can see that Leora and Sheetala and our friends over at Pod2 uh, are on the side of the screen, as you would be in any Zoom meeting. But we're also all looking at our OWL site. And I've just directed us to the page called All Things Virtual to remind you that you can go there to see details about how all of our Zooming uh, is going to go and a little bit more about uh, the class format generally. Um, you can also check out this really cute cat who is as tired of Zoom meetings as I am. Believe me, I wish we could all be in person all the time. I'm hoping that this hybrid thing is going to be the next best thing. Also, before we move away from the share, uh, this is our class WordPress site. So you might want to make sure that you travel over there and check it out. There's a welcome message to you all and all kinds of other goodies, including archive pages. There are links to this in your syllabus and also on our OWL site. So if you know anything about the way I teach, and I know some of you have heard some things already, uh, you'll know that we do a lot of group work in class. And probably this environment has given you a clue as well. So when we're doing group work in class, uh, with some of you on Zoom and some of you live, there's two ways that it's going to go. The first I call the standard, and that is, the folks at one or two pods will be a breakout room. So Leela and Devon would be a room. The folks on Zoom will be in their own breakout rooms. So Leora and Sheetala would be a team. And I would send them into a breakout room for the duration of the group work. 
We're also, however, going to do something I call the advanced, which is I'm going to mix sometimes the Zoom folks and the live folks together. How is that going to work? Well, first thing we're going to need to do is Leela and Devon are going to have to sign into the Zoom meeting. So guys, can I ask you to do that now? And remember to bring your headphones that connect to a computer. Devon and Leela have joined Leora and Sheetala on the Zoom call, and I am going to create a hybrid breakout room with all of them at our virtual pod two. Here we go. I'm going to open the room, and everyone's going to have an invitation to accept to join it. Be sure to do that part. Now, as you can see, Devon, Leela, Leora, and Sheetala are all on Devon's screen, and you guys can all start chatting together about the prompt or question. So now, Devon and Leela, go ahead and get the conversation started. So that's it for now, guys. I'm sure that more stuff is going to come up. Uh, chances are that we're going to have plenty of tech hiccups, and we're just going to have to roll with it and figure stuff out as we go. Rest assured that Sheetala and I want your feedback. If something's not working, if you're finding it stressful, uh, we'll adjust. We'll make changes. And we'll actively ask you throughout the term to keep us up to date on what's working and what's not. Please don't ever feel shy about bringing that stuff to us. But before we go, I just want to remind you that a lot of the questions that I bet are circling around in your heads right now are uh, answered for you on our All Things Virtual page in OWL. So remember, when you're in OWL, scroll down just a little bit to All Things Virtual. This page will tell you all kinds of stuff about how the heck it's going to go. And down here at the bottom, we've got a separate page with some pro tips about how to set up your Zoom space, how to be a good online citizen, and a whole bunch more stuff. If after you've gone through all that information, you still have questions, just get in touch. Remember that I'm K-S-O-L-G-A at uwo.ca. You can reach me through OWL, on email, or you can stop me in the halls on Tuesdays when I will be here on campus live in person. I'm really looking forward to meeting all of you very soon. Bye for now.